Hey guys, in this video I want to run through some tips and pointers to ensure you get your Nuco sleeping crib set up as quickly and safely as possible. Within the box, you should find the following parts. The crib itself, the mattress, the tray fixture, base support bar, and the attachment system. Setting up. Start by laying the baby crib face down. Gently open both legs outwards until they are in a vertical position. Align the base support bar with the holes on either leg and pull up to secure in position. Turn the crib over so it's now standing on all four legs. Align the tray fixture with the four holes on the support feet and gently push down to secure into place. Fasten the six snap buttons to secure the fabric. Place the mattress inside the baby crib and gently push down on all four corners to ensure it remains flat and secure. Adjusting height. Your crib can be adjusted to several different height positions. Start by pressing both these buttons on either side of the crib simultaneously and simply pull the crib up or down. We strongly recommend that both sides are always adjusted to the same height level so your baby sleeps completely flat. Linking to your bed safely. It's of the utmost importance that the attachment system is always correctly used to link your co-sleeper safely next to your bed. Start by unzipping both zips to fully release the side of the crib. Detach the side handrail from the main crib by squeezing the clips and pulling the handrail away from the crib frame. Fold the side of the crib down and securely attach the handrail using these small clips to hold in place. As before, use the buttons on either side of the crib to adjust the height to match the height of your bed. Align the crib directly next to your bed and pass the attachment system underneath your mattress. Adjust the length of the attachment system at the opposite side of your bed by simply pulling like so. Attempt to pull the crib away from your bed, ensuring the attachment system holds the crib securely in place. Thanks so much for watching. We hope you found this useful. If you do have any questions or issues, be sure to send us a Facebook message or email us at hello at evelas.com.